madam. Mr. Fry. Ready to take the air? Devil's Acre should just be coming alive. I'm afraid I must cancel our engagement. The lawn is crawling with scandal-hunting journalists, and I simply cannot be seen in the company of someone so... I'll see them off. You follow along when it's clear. Yes, yes. Uh, be gentle, won't you? The press are notoriously touchy about any violence to their person. Ha, <laughs> I'll barely ruffle a hair on their heads. Shh, Desmond. the way. Walk on, girl. In the car, it's the Prime Minister's wife. I really must not have seen her, Mr. Black. Fine girl. Oh, what a rough place. Give me your arm, Mr. Fry. Let us see what the Devil's Acre has to offer. Your dog quite all right. Oh, Desmond's fine. He's just not over fond of strangers. Or cats. Hush. Do you know this gentleman is a... Oh, what was it? Yes. A costermonger. <laughs> Remarkable how the working classes occupy themselves, isn't it? Very industrious, I'm sure. Shall we go? That was the Eucharist! I'm so sorry. I have no earthly idea what you're talking about. <clears throat> you Mrs. Disraeli. Oh, 
Mr. Fry, look at those two. Uh, yes, they, uh, they seem to be, um... I've been married twice, Mr. Fry. Yeah. I'm fully aware of what they're doing. God bless them. What sort of meat is that man selling? Best not to ask. Why? Is it something dreadful? <gasps> is it rat? I don't mean to be indelicate, given the present company, but another name for it is Bow Wow Mutton. Here we are, the old one-ton... So, this is a pint, is it? Huh? <laughs> Remarkable. <sighs> Nice doggy. Desmond, hand over the mutt. You'll change your tune when me and my friends find you. Now then, Desmond, to get you back to your mistress, whom I've just left entirely unattended in one of London's most dangerous pubs. Well, if you never told your father how you felt about him, how was he supposed to know? I never thought of it that way. I suppose deep down we all just want to be loved. Just so. Mm. Here, have a sweetie. Oh, Desmond and Mr. Fry, I'd like you to meet... Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't catch your name. John the Tosser. Charmed. I think we'd better get you home. Right you are, Mr. Fry. Come along, Desmond. <laughs> Well, well, well. If it isn't the dog walker. <laughs> now, let's not do something we'll regret. Quite right. Lord Cardigan is the gentleman you seek. Tiresome. Always blabbering on about his military adventures. Do you know where I might find him for a private conversation? I do indeed. He's in town now, as it happens, campaigning against the corrupt practices group. Perhaps you could catch him in the Palace of Westminster. Oh, do be careful. The government could ill afford another scam. I assure you, I'll be very discreet. <laughs> 
Your stop, madam. My stop? <laughs> How delightful. Uh, thank you. Thank you for a splendid evening, Mr. Fry. I shall be sure to speak highly of you to Dizzy. <laughs> oh, yes. Mm.